Sagittarius, it's your honest homegirl, Kay Shanique, and this is your homegirl horoscope for today. I feel like a lot of my Sagittarius's, you guys are in boss mode, you are getting things done, many of you are healing, okay, some of you could be associated with an Aquarius, um, you could be asking an Aquarius about some type of healing aspect in your life or how to go about healing something, um, or they healed you from something many of you there's something between you and aquarius and money as well because money's here you could be giving someone money or they could be giving you money you could be thinking about this there's something with finances and having to think about some. Some of you are probably thinking about investing in your healing journey. So some of you may even want to like get a spiritual cleanse. Some of you may want to pay someone to do a reading. Um, you may want to get a spiritual bath. Like there's something that you you may want to invest your money in because you want to end. I hear. Some of you, you want to end overthinking. And then for others of you, you may feel like you have bad luck or I don't say people have bad luck. Sometimes I just feel like you have just unwanted energies that you keep inviting into your energetic field that need to be cleansed away and then left the hell alone. So if there's exes that need to go, they need to go. That don't mean you backtrack and go, hey, how you doing, big head? Or when they do it to you because it's Mercury retrograde and Venus retrograde, that don't mean you go back talking to them. It's time for you to heal from this situation and move on. Just that simple. Because if money, if you feel like money is being blocked, it's probably because you're dealing with somebody, someone's in your energetic field with brokey energy and you need to get them out of it. It's just that simple. That's how you heal your financial situation. Get brokey energy out of your energetic field. It's just that simple. Be around winners and you will always win. Being around losers, you will always lose. And it doesn't even have to be a lover. You got broke friends. And they may not be broke financially. They may just be broken spiritually. Okay? Either way, they still broke. And you need to get brokenness out of your energetic field. Okay? That that's the lesson. That's what you need to learn. That's that's the lesson. Abundance. Eight. What else you need me to say to you? What else you need me to say to you, Sagittarius? Some of y'all are hard-headed. For others of you, you could be... Yeah, some of you are being blocked. Or someone blocked you. Or spirit is blocking you from being with this woman that has children. This could be the mother of your children. You may think that this person is a divine person and this person ain't no damn divine and nothing, okay? They're really a snake in sheep's clothing is what I'm hearing. Um, and you you trying to get your stability and security together. You trying to stay stable and you keep trying to follow something. It's like you want to have a baby with somebody. You want to be doing all types of stuff with somebody. And it's like, no, spirit is going to block this. And for others of you, you may want to go towards someone that could possibly be a divine feminine. Someone that would be the best mother to, to their children. But you have some things that you need to heal. You might be the brokey energy. It, it can go both ways. You could be the brokey energy and spirit is blocking you from coming into this divine feminine's life who is has some type of stability and security for loving on the phone. Or they're blocking you. From going towards this person here because they're the one with the brokey energy and you got a illusion and delusions going on in your brain I'm telling you when your money start looking funny is when something has to go remember that when your money start looking funny you have to analyze what needs to go and get out of your energetic field it's just that simple it ain't got nothing to do with spirituality and nothing to do with religion. It has everything to do with self and understanding of thyself and thyself's energy. Is there anything else? Yeah, because some of you, you're not taking a leap of faith when it comes to yourself. That's the message. Take a leap of faith on yourself. 